Hello everybody, welcome to a new video. You may recall that I built an entry level budget gaming PC for $93 not too long ago. The build was nice, but the particular thing I wasn't that happy with was the graphics performance. It just wasn't enough for me to feel satisfied. But now, I have done some searching around on eBay and found an EVGA GTX 750 Superclock for $43. It isn't the TI version, but regardless, it is a great card that can play newer titles just fine. Now you might be asking how I'm going to fit this card into a PC, because the card is a dual slot high profile card, and the PC can only regularly take low profile cards. Well, if you get a little creative and buy a PCIe X16 riser cable for 9 bucks, the GPU will actually fit just fine. All I did was cut open a spot on the case for the graphics card's I.O., and just laid the card flat to where the fan was facing upwards. When I turned the PC on, I was greeted with a big Dell logo and was able to get into Windows 10 in a matter of seconds. There was no graphics driver installed, but I had prepped one earlier and installed it. The installation was very smooth and gave no errors, and before I knew it, I was ready to play some games. So now that everything is installed and ready to go, here are the benchmarks. Just a side note, I did not overclock the graphics card like I usually do, so these results were at the GTX 750's stock clocks. Anyway, on to the benchmarks. Well, that's it for this video. I'm sorry if it was a little bit short, I just wanted to do an update on this PC. Thank you guys for watching, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.